everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Fire Emblem. The last time we found out a whole bunch of story, like a lot of story. And this time we'll just see where we're going next, so let's hop into the next chapter. After speaking with the Ostian spy Layla, Elliwood realizes he must travel to Valor, the Dread Isle. They head straight to the port city of Badon, seeking passage. After a long journey, they spot a fog-enshrouded isle on the horizon. Elliwood's father is on the isle, as is the Dragon's Gate. As they draw closer to the isle, Elliwood no longer fears that his father might be the one of the conspirators. As the moment of truth nears, Elliwood only prays that he is safe. Chapter 7, Pirate Ship. Ahoy, laddie. You don't get seasick, do you? I'm fine, sir. This is a beautiful ship. <laughs> For a sea rover, eh? May I ask you a question? What is it? Why did you agree to give us passage? When we said we wished to travel to Valor, the people in the harbor treated us as though we were mad. I'm sure they did. It's the Dread Isle, after all. If not for good reason, we wouldn't want to go either. And yet, you've given us free passage. Why is that? Listen to me, laddie. Men are strange beasts. We can't resist a challenge. Something appears on the horizon, and we immediately set sail. Some dreams we conquer, and others we abandon. I've grown old. I haven't had a good challenge in many a year. Then, you moon calves appear seeking passage to the Red Isle. I was impressed with your courage. I think you may be the ones to survive the Red Isle. We won't disappoint you. We will return. All right, then we'll weigh anchor and wait for you. Light a signal fire when you want to return and we'll pick you up. Thank you. Captain, there's a door you drift to port. It looks like there's someone aboard. What are your orders? Bring him aboard. Looks like we've got a visitor. Odd, though, finding a boat adrift near here. Odd? Why is that? The sea currents in this area. Anything drifting around here must have come from the Dread Isle. Oh. Shall we greet our guest? Yeah, let's go say hi. <laughs> Elliwood, you done talking to old man Fargus? You saw us? No, I heard you got off with him. You learn anything? We can trust him. We got lucky finding him. Hmm, you say so. Hey, you two, come here. They pulled the dory aboard. I wonder who's on board. It's... it's a girl? Uh, uh, oh wait, there, that's a girl. Oi, you there. Me? Give me a hand, will you? I don't know where to... Grab her. Okay. Such the gentleman. Stow it. <laughs> I mean, he was nice enough to ask her about that. Hmm? Ninian? Ninian, wake up! Unbelievable. What are the chances? Do you know her? She's how Lindus and I met a year back. I rescued Ninian from a band of villains. Please, Ninian, open your eyes. Uh... Ninian, can you hear me? <coughs> I... Are you well? Why were you on that boat? Where is Niels? Why wasn't he with you? Uh... Uh... Ninian? Lindus, something's wrong with her. Who... Who... Captain! Pirate ships approaching from the northwest! Do they dare attack Captain Fargus and Madavros? They must be mad. What flag are they flying? I've never seen that pattern before. These seas belong to us. Whoever they are, they're in our waters. This is a day for strange occurrences, it seems. You whelps, watch your own highs. We've no time to waste on you. Ooh, ah! Water! The hull's been breached. We're taking on water! Breach! Those scum are more dangerous than I thought. It's bad, Captain. We need all hands below decks or we'll sink. Take care of it. 
I'm going to carve his scalawag some new gizzards. We need your help. The water's up to the galley. You must come below, Captain. Fogus, leave the enemy to us. Fighting is something we're good at. But a sinking ship, that's your affair. You have to do something or we'll all drown. We'll deal with the things up here. Please hurry. Fine, my deck is yours. I'll be back as soon as we plug the breach in the hole. Go! Lynn, take it to that room. I will. Here they come. Oh boy. All we want is a go kill the rest. Oh jeez. Well, all right then. It looks like we're going to have to fight off these bandits. And I've got a feeling that these are the Black Fang. Uh, let's see. Who are we bringing along? I think... Er, Priscilla, Guy, Lynn, Matthew, Wheel. Um... I think I'm happy with what I have right here. I do feel bad for losing Batra in the last episode and also not being able to get those other two characters. But hey, let's just start. Uh, no need for Merlinas this time around. Ahoy! We'll leave the fighting to you! Hold on until we can help! Oh, and we've Merc is aboard. This is the armory. And this is the shop. You won't be able to stock up once we reach the Dread Isle. I suggest you buy as much as possible if you have the chance. Wow. This is, uh... I mean, might as well do that. Let's see, what do we have here? Here we have mostly physical fighters and magical fighters are over here. Also, I can see a line in my recording. I hope it doesn't translate. It probably will. But man, I hate that. Alright, let's yeet that javelin. Yeah, it's the Black Fang, alright. That's for sure. Uh, who else do we have in here? Do we have anyone special? Black Fang, Black Fang, Fang, Fang. You, also a Fang. Fang, Fang, Fang. I don't think there's anyone special aboard, no. Uh, yeah, Zoldam, but that's, that's, that's the bad guy. We just gotta survive, it looks like. Uh, let's see. I don't think it's a good idea to push uh, Florina forward. I kind of want the three Cavaliers to be close by. All right, let's attack six. Five and five, wow. These guys are strong. These guys are not messing around. All right, um, I want you over here. Oh, we check out the armory. This is an armory. I buy and sell all manner of things. He has a lot of things. Steel bow, steel axe, hand axe. Mm, you know what? I think I'll get one of these bows. And also a sword for myself. There we go. Now nah, we're fine. We're fine. Okay. Uh, Marcus. Big old Marcus. You're going to help us survive a whole bunch. Saying you're going to go up here, I believe. 20 and 4 times 2. Well, the thing here is, since I'm on the plank, they won't be able to ambush me with more than one character. So I can just keep Sane over here and make sure that he just takes down these guys one by one. And he got a level up. Level 10. A little bit extra speed and luck. We could all use a bit of speed and luck. My man Loman over here. Um, Let's see. How far can you go? Close enough to go to Florina, and I kind of want to keep you a little sick. You can just stand on the water. That's a good spot for you. All right, I think I'll, I'll take it here. Enemy phase. Yeah, that's about what I expected. If I can get Rebecca behind Sane to offer a little bit of uh, long-range support there, that would be great. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Oof. Can't just take quite some damage from that. Those magic users are, uh, are a problem, to say the least. Would have been great to have Lucius here. Sheesh. Yeah, that is some ouchies. Okay, Hector, um, take care of this guy, please. Yeah, there you go. That's what I like to see. You are going back for some healing, Kent. I don't want to lose you. Yes, excellent. 
Weapon level increase. Okay, I want Rebecca over here. All right, Zane, you just kind of stay there and attack. Yeah. Might be a good idea to just kind of push Oswin forward. He'll be able to, yeah, he'll take a lot of hits because they just won't hit him like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, Lowen and Marcus. I kind of want to make Marcus stand over here so I can make sure that nothing comes from there. But I'm also concerned about these fellows because they might be able to hurt um, him pretty much. Uh, nine times two, iron sword, seven, three. Let's just go with this. This will do. Level up. HP, strength, uh, skill and luck, I mean, there you go. I'll put you over here. Yeah, finish the man off. Ooh, critical hit too. Right, how far can you guys go? Okay, so I'm safe with pretty much everyone. Yeah, I'll keep Florina. Actually, how much damage can Florina do? She deals 8 times 2 but gets 7 back. And then the next turn she will probably die to a double attack, so I don't want to do that. Uh, I think I'm fine for this turn, yes. Oh yeah, no damage. <laughs> there we go. We got a long sword. Oh, only one damage. Yeah, keep it up, my guy. Uh-oh. Okay, that did not do as much damage as I thought it would. I didn't even stop to consider that they might go for Rebecca there. Okay, uh, Marcus, you're gonna stay here. Just hang out. Uh, Oswin, just keep up the good work. Just stab a man. Oh, come on. I said stab the man, not miss the man. Saying, did you have... No, he did not have. In that case... 20. Yeah, 20 is perfect, because then I can finish him with Rebecca and give her some experience. Okay, move up a little. Go in for the pew pew. Whew, nice. Okay, these two. Uh, let's see. Elliewood, can you do something about that? 12... 10 times 2, that is a little better, yeah. So one, oh wow, okay, one hit KO. Thanks to the crit. Uh, let's see. Where can you go? Oh, man. Um, I kind of want to give her a little experience too. All right. It's not much. Uh, Actually, well, let's do this. Staff, heal, Kent. So you're fully healed. Yeah, there you go. Level up for you, too. Wow, four stats. Okay, uh, Loan. These two will appear very quickly. Mm. Here's the thing. Hector, you should be fine, right? 19 times 2. Okay, yeah, let's do that. That's a good amount of experience. I kind of want to make sure Elliewood doesn't die. We'll wait here. Dorcas, follow along. And you can go over here as well. I kind of want to make sure we, we're able to spread out as soon as we can. <laughs> that Black Fang guy is just... It's just like, no, man. Don't even try. Hey, Oswin, you're missing a whole bunch, and I don't like that. Ooh, critical hit. Man, Marcus is really going for it. Really, you want to try... You just saw two of your friends die, and you were like, yeah, I think I could take this one. Ooh, low one taking damage. Gotta watch out. Ooh, low one. Oh, phew. All right, low one's gotta go back. He needs some HP. Luckily, he can run fast, <laughs> and then Sarah can heal from up here. Um, yeah, let's go for a low one first, because I feel like Rebecca might be a little safer behind Oswin down there. Yeah, we should be fine. Uh, Marcus is fine over here, too. He can just put a stop to that. Florina, uh, how much HP do these guys have? Normal, normal, okay. I kind of want to see if I can give her a kill. 10 times 2, 12 and 7. That might work, yes. So, okay, no hits for me. Yeah, yeah, that's what I like. 
Level six, three stat points. Then I come in with you, use my javelin, poke. There we go. A guiding ring. Okay. Now, you can use your wolf bail right there. Chop a man up. Great. And a level up. Man, he's doing exceptionally well. And I like it. Okay, let's see. Um, maybe I can just kind of put Kent before him. Uh, saying you can back up Marcus over there. And Dorkin, how about you just kind of protect over here? Actually, rather than protect, let's go check out his shop. Vulnerary, Dorky, Heal, Mend. What is Mend exactly? Uh, ah, there we go. It stores many HP to allies in adjacent spaces. Okay. You know what? I think I might just bring one. Never a bad thing to have. Cool. Uh, yeah, Oscar, just kind of go for it, my guy. Just Pokemon. Oh, oh, come on! With the missing! Ugh. Man, Oswin's not doing do too, too well in here. I mean, he takes a lot of damage, that's for sure, but he's not dealing it back, which is what the kind of the idea was here. Oh, at least a very good level up. Sheesh. Alright. Alright, two more Dark Megs over there. You know what? I think I'm gonna... Um, Put you on top of that, so no more people come in. And they just kind of end these people. <laughs> oh my god, another critical hit. Marcus is doing so well. We got a red gem there. Uh, let's see. Rebecca. Shoot a man. Yeah, I just shoot him. Osman's going to miss anyway, so I think if I have a vulnerary... I do not have a vulnerary. Alright, fine. I'll just... Uh, Lucas attack. 54. I mean, no wonder if he's missing. Alright. Oh, yeah. There we go. Got some pure water. Now, um... I want you to move down slowly. You're gonna wait here. We're going to... Oh, no. Come on, man. Um, you know what? Yep, I'm doing that. I just wanted to trade the item. Uh, yes, we're going to trade Mend to you. Yeah, that'll work. Is that cheat? I guess it is cheating, but man, I just wanted to switch the items and... Uh, let's see, Black Fang. That guy's down there. It would be great if I could just kind of take him down. Can you take one of these guys down in one hit? Uh, let's see. Heavy Spear. The fact that they deal 9 damage back is a problem. <laughs> I think it might be better to just have them come to me. I will equip my javelin, make sure that's equipped so we can fight back. And I'll also have Hector over here. Um, do you have anything that needs to be switched? Uh, steel sword, culinary, steel bow. Actually, instead... We're going to make sure we go over towards Rebecca so we can trade that bow to her. All right, let's see. Oh, boy. Phew. Well, that side's taken care of. Ooh, that's a nasty amount of damage. Oh, my goodness. I was afraid that might happen. Okay, um, Rebecca. Trade with Elliewood. We're going to grab that steel bow. And that should be good. Uh, what else does he have in his inventory? Steel, silver. Okay, he has nothing more. Dorcas is an energy ring. Yeah, okay. Right, right. We need to start moving back. Uh, you definitely need a little bit of healing there. We'll use mend. Let's see how much that does. Whoa, pretty much his entire HP bar. Kind of happy with that. All right, uh, Saint, you're just going to stay there. Mark is going to come over here. We need to either take these guys out or... Um, let's see. Get those guys out of there. Okay, Kent. 
let's see. Wow, my phone is going. I should have put that on silent, which is exactly what I'm going to do now. Otherwise, we're going to hear that beeping even more as the night goes on. There we go. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll just take the hit. Ugh, I hate that, though. But we did get a level up. Wick is good. Two points. I'll take that. Florina, can you approach without getting yourself in a whole lot of trouble? How far can you go? That's the real question. You can definitely hit someone that's going to approach. 1989. Let's go! Oh, thank goodness. Okay. The wolf's bill broke. That. that was his last weapon, was it not? I need to get, like, some other weapon to him. You are going to stand over here. Uh, what does this do? Okay, I should probably give that to someone else. We'll just wait over here. Who else do we have? Oh, Lone. My man. Who else? Yeah, okay. Saying you're gonna stay here. Alright. Oh, no. Oh, thank goodness he missed. Okay, uh, Ellie Wood. My good friend, Ellie Wood. Eleven, yeah, okay, do it. Ooh, oh, he healed. I did not like him healing. Okay, um, you. Damn, you, you just barely cannot reach, huh? Okay, here's the thing. I want to prevent any more forces from coming. So this is my move. Chop him down. There we go. Very good. Uh, Sarah. Okay. I'm gonna move you over here. Yes. And move you. Oh, one more. There we go. Staff. Let's do a regular heal. He doesn't need that much. Excellent. Rebecca, you're approaching. Marcus, you're going to come and proc as well. Uh, Dorcas. <sighs> I need to buy some... How much inventory space do we have? I need to buy some axes on Dorcas and give them over to Hector. Alright, yeah. Uh, I'll buy two steel axes and one hand axe. And then next turn, we're just gonna switch and move them around. Move around to the enemy ship's stern. That's where they should be waiting. That's where they'll die. Oh, really? They just put them over there? They altered the map. That's not what I want. All right, we need to do something. Okay, okay. Here, here, here's the plan. We're going to send the strongest guy in there and kill him. Yeah. It's not even enough experience for him anymore. All right, you're going to move over there. Staff, heal, Rebecca, please. Why, thank you. All right, uh, Dorcas, approach Hector. We're going to trade. Uh, we're going to bring you one steel axe and a hand axe. Now that should keep him busy for a little while. All right, Hector, move in. Use your shiny new hand deck. 50% mm, chance to hit. I don't like those odds in the slightest. Okay, um, you cannot make that. How far can you go? Because I think it's it's those greats that do it, don't it? Or is it just this guy that's so heckin' slippery? How far can you go? You can go pretty far as well. Mm. I'll just put Oswin here to be safe. You're going up ahead to the other guy. Uh, I kind of want to defeat that guy too. Let's go over the... No, actually, we need to... No. <laughs> Double no. Wait here. You. Wait there. I don't want to deal with reinforcements from these guys. Uh, you are going to stay behind here. And that should be it for now. Let's see what they do. That guy's going uh, to an alive himself. Oh, the steel lance broke. You know, I didn't think they would all just kind of throw themselves upon Marcus. You'd think they would be smarter than that. 
Where do they all come from? I thought I put people on top of the cases just to make sure they don't do that, and then they do it anyway. What's up with that? All right. No worries. 19. That'll be fine. Folks, that's what we like to see. All right, so we got a flyer here. They won't be able to reach Florina, so I'm just going to kind of stick where I am, so to say. How far can these guys go? Not far enough. They're kind of slow, actually. All right, put them here. Uh, they have a lot of stuff. Wait. And you. Let's come in. Here's your staff. No, no need to use staff. We'll just, we'll just wait here. I think we're fine. I think we're fine. Those guys are slow. Sane is taking care of him. Heck yeah, there you go. Yeah, we got some flyers coming in. Okay. Let's go flyer v flyer. Let's not go flyer v flyer. <laughs> no, that's not a good idea in the slightest. Uh, would love to be able to just get him, you know. Can we... Attack from there? Yes! <laughs> Goodbye, flying person. And our weapon level increased. Okay, we got two black fangs right here. What are we going to do? Um, Let's put them in front. And then they can just come to me. And the next turn, I might be able to uh, destroy a couple of them with Rebecca. You're fine. <clears throat> Pardon me. Fine over there. This one's not going for Rebecca. That's just a bad idea in their part. I'm fine. Yep, expected. Ooh, with the critical hit. And a sweet level up. Level 12, HP and luck. Wow, they're really just going for it, huh? At least now Rebecca can finish him off. Really? You're going for Rebecca? That's not a good idea. I'm going to shoot you down now. That's going to hurt you a whole lot. Yeah. Wow, that was uh, a genuinely bad idea. Right. Uh, let's see. Well, I, I guess I did. I'm just going to move you back a couple feet. And that should be the end of it. You think you could take down Sane? Sane takes down you. Level up. Good level up. Good level up. Ahoy, I'm back. Now, who wants to die first? Well, there's only one guy left. <laughs> We've routed him. Thanks to your quick work, we managed to survive. Hmm. Ah, Ninian, you can't come out yet. There's blood everywhere. Blood? Look out. Ah, I'm sorry. Also, I forgot my voice. I had some water in my lungs earlier, and now I sound like this again. Are you okay, Ninian? Ninian? Is that me? Is that my name? Ninian, what's happened to you? I... My head is so foggy. Am I... At sea? Yes, we found you adrift in a small boat. Those scum were after the girl, it seems. Will you take her with you? The men are afraid she... Well, she might be cursed, you know. Cursed? Are you suggesting we leave Ninian behind? We can't take her with us, can we? We're heading for the Dread Isle. It's dread for a reason, you know. Regardless, she goes with us. Alignus? When I saw her, I remembered something. The last time I saw Ninian, she and her brother were being hunted by some dark-robed men. Dark-robed? Are you sure? Yes, I think it must be the Black Fang. It didn't occur to me before, but now I'm certain. How can you be so sure? I can't explain. There's something in the air that hints at their involvement. If it's true, then she's likely to be attacked again. Almost certainly. We can't leave her behind. I will watch over her, please. I understand. We should be by her side to protect her. Thank you. 
We're all going to Bed Island. Will you come with us? Yes. Please, take me with you. Well, that's going to be it. Thanks to some very kind pirates, we managed to get to the Dragon Isle, or Dread Isle, sorry. And maybe we even made some friends along the way. Next time, we're going to be exploring the Dread Isles. But before then, I would like to thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope to see you again here next time for some more Fire Emblem. But until then, bye-bye!